Hey everyone, today's tutorial is of my lace up shoes that I made. Um, it's not a hard DIY at all, pretty much very simple. Uh, there I am wearing them and they are they wore really well. First thing you want to do is get all of your um, supplies. I have bought these shoes at Charlotte Russe uh, about six months ago and they were sitting in my closet <laughs> waiting for this. My hole punch, some scissors, some leather, scrap leather I got at uh, Hobby Lobby, some laces, suede laces I got at Walmart, and some Eileen's glue, ultimate glue, waterproof. That's really good glue to use. First thing you want to do is you're going to punch your holes in your shoe. Don't be afraid uh, to do this. Uh, I am actually going to do this to a leather pair. These are not real leather. Um, sometimes it's a little harder, but you want to line up your first hole is going to be right in the middle Push down really hard. I kind of swivel it a little and then you have three holes on each side uh, Match them up to your first shoe that I I pinpointed my first shoe and then I worked off this shoe from that I did three on each side. So seven holes total one in the front and three on the sides and once you get all your holes punched in and they if you have any scraps you want to cut those off now you want to put your little uh, well right here I'm gonna do my lace measure my laces so I measured about eight to nine feet depending on how long you want them I cut a string first to do this because it's a lot easier to measure and make them both even so about a nine foot string and then you cut that in a slant so it'll lace easier. And here um, I'm getting ready to organize my string together. It took me, I don't know why it took me so long to do this, but uh, folded it in half and I was trying to get it organized, I guess. So it kept raveling up on me. Um, now you're going to take your little uh, scrap leather and cut two little strips, about two inches long, almost an inch wide. This is going to go on the back of your shoe to hold your laces. You take your glue and put a little bit of glue on the inside and push that together and hold that down for a few minutes or a few seconds. Then you're going to add some more glue on the edge and that's going to adhere to the back of your shoe. It adheres pretty quickly. I hold it down with a clothespin uh, to because it's going to have to sit 24 hours. You make sure you let this sit for 24 hours so it will stay and it will keep that bond. Now you're going to lace your shoes. Take your lace and fold it in half and you put the middle through and then you're going to lace the other two long pieces through that. That anchors it. And now you are just going to lace up your shoes. Uh, you can lace under or over. I laced under this time, but I did change it to over uh, because I think it was a little more comfortable wearing. Uh, lacing them down from the outside in instead of from the inside out. And you just want to lace those up. You can add more holes if you want to. I just did three, uh, but you could do more. You could put these as close together as you want to. You could do four on each side or you know five all the way up to the edge however you want uh, to do this if you don't like three and you want more so you lace these up then you're going to want to string it through your little loop you made in the back and um, then you're gonna wrap them around your ankles when you put them on and wear them I wore these all day uh, I wanted to wear them to make sure that they worked and they weren't uncomfortable they were comfortable uh, I work on my feet eight hours, so they were uh, they lasted all night. I didn't have a problem. There's a little still shot of them done, and then I will have some on me so you can see how they look on. I really like them a lot. And then these I added a little tassel to. Uh, you can add little tassels or whatever. But um, and that is it. Thanks you guys so much for watching. If you want written instructions, you can go to my blog, wobisobi.com, and uh, send me an email if you have any questions. Thank you. Have a great day.